everyone this video lecture is for the topic garbage collection this is from this topic is from the second unit of principles of programming languages garbage collection is nothing but collecting or gaining memory back which has been allocated to objects but which is not currently in use in any part of the problem garbage collection is the process in which programs try to free up memory space that is no longer used by the object it is implemented differently in different languages most high level programming languages have some sort of garbage collection built in low level programming languages may add garbage collection through the libraries every programming language has their own way of performing garbage collection developers need to take care of memory allocation and deallocation using mlloc and dealloc functions in case of c hash developers don't need to take care of gc and it's not recommended either in c hash memory allocation of objects happen in a managed heap which is taken care by the common language runtime memory allocation for the heap is done through win32 dll in os and similarly in c c objects are placed in memory wherever there is free space that fits in the size of the object also memory mapping works based on the linked list concept in c hash memory allocation for the heap happens in a linear manner one after another whenever a new object is being created memory is allocated in the heap and the pointer is moved to the next memory address memory allocation in c hash is faster than c this is because in c the memory needs to be searched and allocate for the object so it will take a bit more than uh, c hash in dartnet programming the heap has three generations called generation 0 1 and 2 garbage collection is a tool that saves the time for programmers for example it replaces the need for functions such as mlloc and free which are available in the c language if an object has no references then it is eligible to gar for the garbage collection that object can be removed from the memory so that the memory can be available to the another next data item <coughs> One example of garbage collection is ARC. It is automatic reference counting. This is used in Swift language. So that's all about the topic garbage collection. <coughs>